Hey guys, my name is Abhishek Verma and welcome to the whole new course of Python programming language. In this video lecture, I will give introduction about what is Python and what can Python do and why you should use Python. So let's get started. Python is a general purpose, interpreted, interactive, object oriented and high level programming language. Here interactive simply means that you can quickly and conveniently running single lines or blocks of code. If we go to the terminal by pressing Ctrl Alt plus T and write Python, hit enter, it will open the prompt where we can write Python code or commands. By default, in Linux Ubuntu systems, it is installed by default. So to pr print out something on the screen, we use print function. So we'll use print parenthesis inside the parenthesis we will write some text inside the double inverted comma like this is an interactive mode hit enter and it gives the instant output so this is called an interactive mode in windows search for ideally by going to the start button and search for ideally python 3.7 it will open the interactive shell or mode which is python 3.7.0 and the same will write in print function inside the parenthesis will write this is an interactive mode and hit enter and the same output will be, it will give as a text which is this is an interactive mode object oriented simply means or you can say is a popular approach to solve a programming problem by creating objects as everything is object in python it is also known as oops and by high level means that python code is easy to read and write and the general purpose interpreted means it can python is using interpreter python's built-in interpreter executes the source code directly in a layman language, interpreter executes the program line by line, whereas the compiler, for example, used by Java, translates the source code of the program into another language format that can be directly executed by a lower level machine. It was created by Guido Van Rossum during 1989s. Like Perl, Python source code is also available under the GNU, which is General Public License or GPL. Python supports the development of a wide range of applications from simple text processing to web development to games. In the next slide, we'll discuss about the key features or we can say what can Python do and why you should we should use Python. First of all, it is easy to learn, read and maintain. Python has a support for an interactive mode which allows interactive testing and debugging of snippets code python is portable which means it can run on wide variety of hardware platforms like windows linux macintosh and raspberry pi or and many more systems or hardware platforms it can run on python provides interfaces to all major commercial databases such as mysql postgresql mongodb which is a nosql or big data Oracle and so on. Python is nowadays highly used in web application development. For example, we can use Django framework or Flask framework to create web application. Python supports GUI applications which are GUI or graphical user interface applications and image processing applications. Python gives you an easy to use interface to create prototypes or we can say software prototypes object oriented programming comes built in into python language it is a po powerful debugging tool to debug the source code it supports automatic garbage collection garbage collection or just collector is a form of automatic memory management it is a way to free up the memory occupied by objects or we can say variable that are no longer in use by the program for example in other languages like java we need to manually delete objects that are no longer needed for garbage collection but in python the process is automatic python is perfect for machine learning 
and complex data analysis and visualization which is a whole new concept of machine learning in python and an, and is an advanced com concept so overall with python you can develop almost anything in terms of software so what are the major industries using python google is using python nasa instagram youtube quora and so on are the major industries that are using python and there are many more opting for the python instead of java so its popularity is now high nowadays so in this video series learn python the easy way we will use python 3.7 yes which is being a latest version operating system we will use is ubuntu which is a linux distribution or debian based system and the version we will gonna use is 14.04 and the text editor we're gonna use is Aram text editor which is being a popular text editor to code on so this is the basic introduction to get started with python please do subscribe my channel and share my videos see you guys in the next video lecture